Hello and welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. And to our returning viewers, thank you for joining us again. In my last video, I told you that Sheikh Hamdan agreed to the surrogacy decision of Sheikh Mohammed. After showing hesitation, Sheikha Thani also agreed to that decision. If you haven't caught up on those episodes yet, don't worry. You can find them in the card on the top right corner of your screen. Trust me, you don't want to miss them. First of all, I would like to tell you to turn on subtitles in your language. Especially if you don't understand English, please click this and next select captions. Then you will see many languages. Select your language from that list. Then you will see subtitles in your language. So, sooner or later, Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikh Athani are going to have another baby through surrogacy. Then you may wonder what will happen to Hadiya Zen, Sheikh Hamdan's second wife. Does Hadiya know about this decision? Let's dive in. On March 6, 2024, Sheikh Hamdan visited Hadiya's mansion with a heavy heart, intending to share troubling news with her. Despite his sadness, he mustered the courage to reveal everything to Hadiya. Her reaction was immediate tears, deeply affected by the news, as she harbors strong feelings for Sheikh Hamdan. Though he reciprocates her emotions, Hadiya now questions if Sheikh Hamdan's love for her has waned. Sheikh Hamdan had to leave the mansion promptly upon receiving a call from Sheikh Hathani, instructing him to attend lunch. As Sheikh Hamdan departed, Hadiya became increasingly upset. This led to an argument between them. Initiated by Hadiya reminiscing about Shama al Falasi's past birthday. Sheikh Hamdan, feeling more distressed, remained silent as Hadiya expressed her feelings of being less important. Despite his departure, Sheikh Hamdan later called Hadiya from his palace, but she did not answer. Sheikh Hamdan called his second wife, Hadiya Zen, after a few hours. Hadiya answered the phone and Sheikh Hamdan apologized to her for his decision, explaining his family situation. Although Hadiya understood, she still questioned him about Shama. Sheikh Hamdan elaborated on Shama's perspective, but Hadiya remained unimpressed. Recognizing Hadiya's feelings, Sheikh Hamdan said, I treat you well, 
Shama has not done anything against you. Plus, she is the only one who understands me among three of you. Then Hadia felt really sad. Then Sheikh Hamdan cut the call. However, considering Sheikh Hamdan's perspective, his feelings are valid. While everyone pursues their desires, few show genuine concern for him. Sheikh Hamdan feels isolated and unacknowledged. It's not solely about his romantic relationships, rather it's about finding someone who truly comprehends him. Despite being 26, Shama respects Sheikh Hamdan's autonomy and doesn't impose restrictions on him, which is why he appreciates her understanding. On the same day, Hadia Zen took to her Instagram to express her emotions through a poignant love poem laden with sorrow. In my upcoming video, I aim to delve into the depths of her verse, sharing both the original composition and its translation, unraveling the intricate layers of her melancholic sentiments. This is the poem image which had shared by Hadia Zen. However, according to the latest information, Sheikh Hamdan's second wife, Hadia Zen is suffering from high fever after their argument. So, these are the latest updates on Sheikh Hamdan and his family. I hope you found something interesting from this video. If you liked my video, please subscribe and hit the bell icon below so that you won't miss any of my other videos. Thanks for watching.